Hi, I'm Ian Stables, Senior Project Manager here at Burton Boat Company, and this is Brynhild, a 1958 Bermudan sloop designed by Fred Parker. Brynhild arrived here at Burthen on the 4th of October 2019. She's a classic example of a fast cruising sloop from the drawing board of Fred Parker, who was a prolific yacht designer in the 1950s and 60s. Brynhild was built by A.H. Moody in Swanwick in 1958. She's mahogany on oak and has been in the same family ownership for the last 40 years. She has been competing in famous classic sailing yacht regattas in the Mediterranean for over a decade. Most recently, the Hill Robinson Voile d'Antibes and Monaco Classic Week La Belle Classe at her home yacht club of Monaco. Built 61 years ago, Brynhild has had numerous minor refits and repairs throughout her years, but nothing quite to the extent of her present restoration in our big blue sheds. Suffering for a number of leaks through the traditionally laid corked teak decks, the refit commenced by lifting the well-worn planks, exposing the deck beams, carlings and support structure to the light of day for the first time since build. With varying degrees of rot exposed in the structure from water ingress over time, suspicions were raised over the shear strake, the bulwarks, the transom knee and the transom. With the deck structure stripped back and the areas of immediate concern identified, work began to draw up a comprehensive work list that would see Brynhild returned to her former glory. The tasks on the list would be achieved over a thorough refit using a combination of traditional skills and modern techniques and materials to ensure a blend of traditional appearance and advantages of superior modern performance where appropriate. Our highly experienced and skilled team of shipwrights determined that in addition to a new deck, Brynhild would need the complete deck structure exposed, disassembled, beams repaired, and refurbished where we can and replaced where necessary. Her transom would also need to be removed and assessed for viability of repair, along with the transom knee, the shear strake, shear clamp, and much of the hull planking aft were suffering from decay, and each item comprising the essential structure of the yacht underwent a similar evaluation. It was decided that the replacement deck would be laid onto a high quality marine plywood subdeck to achieve the appearance of a traditional teak laid deck, including dummy deck seams to the underside of the plywood, but with the benefit of no visible fastenings and significantly improved strength and watertight integrity. In our next video, we'll take a more detailed look at some of the structural repairs that were needed on Brynhild.